Hi, we've popped down the carp quarry today and we're going to be doing a bit of margin fishing. This is the swim we're going to be fishing. This is swim one and uh, our plan is today to land a 30 pound carp and catch it from within four or five foot of the edge. Where the buzzers are there, we're literally just going to be off down there, three or four foot out, that's in about something like 12 to 15 foot of water. It's a warm muggy day, it's quite overcast, so it should be quite good for the fishing today. This is the rig we're going to be using, nothing special. Safety clip lead system. We're using a fluorocarbon hook link. The reason I'm doing that is because the water's crystal clear. And again, like last time, I'll be fishing these with slack lines, no bobbins on. The boilie we have on there is a black pepper and peach. The other boilies that we'll be using will be a Scopex squid and red robin. So they're just, they're 15 mil and the peach one is 18 mil. Together with that, as a freebie baits, we're going to throw out some of the pellet. Now, all the pellet is the pellet that the fish were fed on from when they were babies. It's about 8 mil and looks like that. It's a really high quality, high protein pellet to make the fish grow really fast and they love the stuff so we're going to be putting down one or two handfuls of that a couple of whole boilies a couple of crushed boilies and that's it you don't have to go mad with a bait we'll be fishing like i said slack lines so that there's no resistance or you know we don't really want guitar strings floating through the water or anything like that and the most important thing when you're doing this sort of fishing is make sure you have your clutch set properly because when you do hook into a 30 pound plus carp right next to the edge it's going to be angry and it's going to go like a bat out of hell that's it that's the rods out i'm just keeping low because i don't want any fish to see me now there certainly is an awful lot of activity right on the opposite side of the lake which is always the way but Here's hoping we're going to have one or two fish underneath the rod tip. Uh, all the baits I'm using, you can get when you're at Carp Quarry. No problem about any of that. Uh, new for 2011, just to make it easier to get here and cheaper and quicker, we're actually starting to do uh, tackle hire so that you can fly in. Uh, we take exclusive bookings or single bookings whatever you want to do I'm sure there's a package that's uh, suitable for you well we've been here about half an hour and this is the result of the first run She's going like a steam train, she don't want to stop. Lucky the lake's fairly small, otherwise I'd be out of line. I better put the camera down and concentrate and try and land it. I don't really know who's the most knackered, me or her. nice big old what looks like a two-tone mirror gosh she's still got some fight in her oh, don't try and film and fight a 30 pound carp at the same time it's not good 
should be ready for the net soon, hopefully. Oh, come on, girl. Oh. Now you see why it's so important to have that clutch set properly when you're margin fishing. Because they do go. Oh. That was on the uh, squid scope X. Let's try and get her in the net. I think we might hit our target at a 30 pounder. Come on, a little bit further, girl. There she is. She's in the net. Oh, right. Let's get her out and have a proper look. Oh, there she is. Beautiful old uh, mirror. Lovely condition. A little bit of a dicky dorsal, but it's a nice old fish. Let's get her weighed and see what she comes in at. Well, that's our first 30. She uh, comes in at 32 pound. See if I can get you to have a better look at her. Come on, girl. She's not behaving. Here we go. 32 pound, can't quarry me mirror. Let's get her back in the water. Well, that's what fishing at Carp Quarry is all about. 32 pound of Carp Quarry mirror in half an hour of fishing within three foot of the bank. The rod's back out there. Let's see if we can get another one. And that one took the uh, Squid Scope X and Red Robin Boily. Well, the other one's now shut off, so this is on the peach and black pepper. So let's concentrate and see if we can get it in. Well, it's another good mirror. I don't think she's as big as the first one, but we'll see. But she's not in the net yet. She's still a fair old lump. What do you mean saying she's not as big? That's still a fair old lump of fish. Look at the paddle on that. Beautiful girl, isn't she? Let's get her weighed and see what she comes in at. Well, this one's coming at 28. So we'll get her out, let you have a better look at her. Nice fish though. Still a fair old lump. Look at that. 28 pound of carp quarry in there. Beautiful. Let's stop messing about with these 28s and 32s. Let's get a 40. We'll get her back. Well, this was the one we were hoping for. Big old mirror. Scaled in. 45 pound. Let's see if I can get her up. Oh, this is a. Oh, there she goes. 45 pound of carp quarry mirror. Look at that beast. I can hardly lift her. That's, a, that's what you can catch from fishing three foot out in the margins. Just remember when you come a carp quarry. Don't forget oy, to have one in the margins because this is the sort of fish that can produce 45 pound of mirror carp. You too can have that when you come on your holiday to carp quarry. Let's get her back. Now I'm all slimed up. <laughs> 